How's it going everybody? My name is Killer743 and welcome back to a brand new video. Now in today's video we're going to be talking about three different topics. I'm going to leave the times on the comment section below. That way you guys can just click on it and just listen to that specific topic without listening to the other two. Alright, I don't want to like keep you guys here long so... All right, let's just get into it. So for the first topic, of course, we're gonna talk about the giveaway. I'm gonna cut into that just now, all right? So let's just get right into it. All right, boys, and here we are. Now, if you guys see like, it's kind of cropped out and you see like two big black bars or lines on the bottom and top, that's because I was playing with this and there is a place number one already, but I was just playing around with the randomator because, you know, I kind of wanted to see if it was legit and actually, you know, fair, and it is actually. I was playing with many. I didn't want to use the common one, but I said, fuck it, let's use this one gives me what I want and well it took me a while to get all you guys uh, names in here it took me like a few hours not that many but here we are again I apologize for the delay kind of had to fix some my some things out in my uh, real life right now I got a little lazy as well too <laughs> but overall here we are and well again if you guys didn't win the giveaway don't be so disappointed all right it's 10 million I mean it sounds like a lot but I mean the other one I'm going to do and that might be my final one for a while is the death Frontier 2 giveaway you're and I bet you're asking what are you gonna give away killer well I have the Wraith Cannon, and as you all know, and I bought a lot of credits. So once Death Frontier uh, 3D, you know, our items from there transition to Death Frontier 2, I'm probably going to give away one of those super rare items to one of you guys. So, you know, watch out for that, look out for that. We will have a, a, another giveaway very soon. And after I do that giveaway, I will be done with giveaways for a while, and I'll, be, I'll just be sticking to Death Frontier 2. So without further ado, guys, let's do this. All right. Drum roll. Three, two, one. The best engineer, congratulations. You have won the giveaway. All right, best engineer, let me see if I can find you in the thing. And here we are, guys, the best engineer. If I win, I'll start playing again. Good luck to everybody, all right? I know, guys, again, it took a while, but <laughs> I wanted to give everybody a bit of a chance to also, you know, apply. Again, don't feel disappointed. And the best engineer it appears you'll be playing once again. Congratulations on the 10 million giveaway, all right? Now this is where the giveaway ends guys, remember when Death Frontier 2 comes out I'll be giving away, giving away one of those super rare or whatever cosmetics Ammon will give us Wraith Cannon users, alright, so yeah look out for that. Alright, on to the next topic. Now basically in Death Frontier 3D my membership has officially ran out, you know, it ran out like two weeks ago, that's why I haven't uploaded a single Death Frontier video because I'm just like, do I really want to extend my membership? Because honestly, there's only three selections. That is the, the freaking monthly one where you have to basically put in your card information and money is taken out of your card every month, which I really don't want to do. And the second thing, then the second option of paying is just basically six months, which is basically you pay $46, I believe, for the membership. But it's six months of membership and I know I won't be getting back in 3D after 2 is released. And of course, the third one is basically 12 months, which is just I'm not going to buy, honestly. So, I mean, right now I'm just in a very conflicted position because... I mean, you know, this channel is basically about the frontier, and I really don't just want to upload, you know, any just, you know, just discussion topics of me just blabbering about specific topics, which is that frontier two, what is going to happen? Because I really don't want to sound like a scratch disc, like a repeating disc, you know, on replay. It's just it gets a little boring after a while. So I don't know. I really don't know. I mean, me and Kiko probably would not continue the series of you know hardcore gameplay because you know seven days you die. We have it on the hardest difficulty. It's like two hits to us and we die. But we're having a blast on it. We're making a house. We're reinforcing. We're crafting. It's just, it's just a more fun game than 3D at the moment, and we're just enjoying every second of it, which is why I hope you guys really you know, like come with us in this adventure with us. We're gonna go as far as we can, get you the best base, best weapons, basically to the point that. We're so on top of everything that we just don't want to continue because we get bored. <laughs> so it might be a while. So yeah, guys, if you guys have any uh, like video ideas for Death Hunter 3D, just put them put them in the comment section below, and I'll be very grateful. I mean, I'll take some of your considerations because you know we I, I didn't get here by myself. I got here because of you guys. So you know, feel free to leave any you know um, open ideas. All right, <clears throat> I'm open to them, and I'll, if I find them very entertaining or a very entertaining idea. I'll take it. Now, of course, we got the final topic, which is Seven Days to Die. Now, Seven Days to Die is, is an open world, you know. It just reminds me so much of Death Frontier 2 because, obviously, first and foremost, the graphics. Although Death Frontier 2 may be a bit more ahead in graphics, I mean, here it's like an open world, so they had to do a bit of sacrifice to it. But, I mean, it's highly enjoyable. You don't need an ov overall powerful PC. You can play in the lowest quality, and your PC will just keep up with it, which is like, again, it reminds me of Death Frontier because it's like the creator actually you know 
had the idea that not everybody has a powerful PC, which is very cool of them. So, I mean, the game is like, what, $20, $30? It's a little, yeah, expensive, but when you play with, like, your friends, like me, I'm playing with Kiko, it's just a very fun and open world. Like, I, I just love every bit of it. Like, for me, I died, like, already six times in the series. <laughs> I mean, it's only day eight, and I die six times, but that's because we're in, like, on the hardest difficulty. But, but that's what makes the game fun, you know? We have it in the hardest difficulty. It's not like, it's more realistic, you know? In real life, you wouldn't go off against 10 zombies and survive, you know? In real life, if I see, like, let's say one zombie, I'm gonna freak out because I'm like, damn, if that thing gets a hand, like, his hands on me and I can't break loose, I'm, I'm screwed. And the fact is that so many things play into this game, which is basically, you know, obviously build your house, build the base, you know, make it strong, put spikes, put traps, put everything, you know, you need bows, you need arrows, you need guns, you need everything to survive. And things like hunger, thirst, uh, sickness, you know, you even have like if you eat something like let's say you, you eat unpurif eat, you drink unpurified water, you basically get sick and you start pooping your brains out, you know, it's pretty fun, you know, you have infection, you know, if a zombie hits you, you can get infected and you have like a limited amount of time before you die of infection and you turn into one of them. You know, it's it's a very fun game and honestly I can't see myself in Kiko quitting this game anytime soon. But of course that doesn't mean I'm gonna give up on Death Frontier because again, Death Frontier is what made this channel in the first place and I'm never gonna forget where I came from, you know. It's like I'm never gonna be embarrassed admitting that I played Death Frontier. It's a very fun game and of course if it wasn't going anywhere, Admin would have just quit at Death Frontier 3D and that's it, you know, but obviously he sees the potential in this game, which is why he is creating Death Frontier 2. And of course, with all the updates that are coming out of this game, I'm more than excited to continue the series of Death Frontier, you know. It's a game that I will never really stop uploading on my channel, you know. You know, I could have 100,000 subscribers, but at the end of the day, it's what I do in this channel, you know. I'm basically going to focus just on zombie uh, related games, you know, zombie related games are just so much fun for me, you know, just any other game that I, let's say, outside of zombie uh, category that I like, I'm gonna play it, but like things like Fortnite, you know, it was fun, but it's not something that seems to go with my channel, you know, it's like basically having a mercenary and then you have a, like, a, your, your average street punk, you know, it's like, who's gonna win in a fight, a mercenary or your average street punk uh, fighter, your gangster, you know, it's, that's a horrible analogy, anyway, <laughs> Without further ado, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Congrats to the giveaway winner. Hope you hope you use that money pretty well, you know, to a million. You know, take advantage of it. And without further ado, this is Killer743, setting off. Peace.